Hello everyone, in this video, let's talk about the best apps for Jira. This is probably one of the most uh, popular and mostly asked question on uh, the community or maybe if you do a quick Google search, you will realize that uh, many people ask this question about uh, what are the most popular apps for Jira, uh, please give me a list of top five add-ons that I need to use for my Jira instance. Well, I want to make this video to clarify something. Jira as a tool is quite configurable. You can customize the tool to a great extent and that is probably one of the most important feature of Jira. So to answer this question, what are the most popular or the best apps for Jira? The answer is basically very simple. It really depends on your requirements. Maybe you don't really need any app. Maybe you can just use Jira out of the box. And this is my recommendation. When you install Jira for the very first time, or maybe if you are using Jira in your organization uh, for maybe a new team, or this is the very first time you are using this tool, try to use it as it is. Try to probably do some piloting in the company and uh, explore all the features of the tool and then figure out uh, what things are missing. You can do a lot of things in Jira, but there are certain things which are probably not there and you need to use an add-on, you need to use an app. For example, if you want to do test management in Jira, you can definitely use Jira natively for doing test management, like a lightweight test management suite. You can create your own custom issue types for test cases. You can also create some custom issue types for test campaign. You can have your, your own custom workflow. But that customization won't really give you everything. And there will be a point where you might realize that you need to use an add-on that will probably bring in those uh, standard features of uh, a test management uh, tool. And in that case, you can definitely use tools like X-Ray, you can use tools like Zephyr, and there are, of course, a couple of other uh, uh, apps like Test Management for Jira. So you can uh, take a look at those apps. So my point is very simple. It really depends on what you want to do with the tool. Maybe you have, let us say, a set of... Uh, 10 requirements from uh, uh, for your maybe your expectations that you think you need to have in a tool. So try to do some gap analysis. Try to look at what all you can do in Jira out of the box. What all you can do in Jira with an app and what all you can do in Jira maybe with some customization, maybe with some custom add-on or maybe with the help of some custom scripting. Even when it comes to add-ons, there are different factors. Factors like the cost, factors like uh, uh, maybe you need a specific features that can be fulfilled with maybe two or three apps. So you need to evaluate those uh, different apps that will probably be more suitable for your requirement. So all I'm saying is that don't really bother about uh, top five apps or the most popular apps when it comes to Jira. It is all about what you want to do in uh, your instance and uh, look at your instance, look at your requirements and then figure out uh, the apps that are probably relevant for you. So this is all I wanted to share in this video and I hope you enjoyed uh, watching this video. Thank you very much.